With the 67th pick of the 2022 Major League Baseball Draft, the Baltimore Orioles select Judd Fabian, an outfielder from the University of Florida. The Minnesota Twins are next. And this is a pick the Orioles acquired from the Marlins via trade. And Red Sox fans, Jim, are going, I heard Judd Fabian's name last year in the second round to the Red Sox. Yeah, it was interesting because the Orioles wanted him bad last year, uh, Jonathan. They took Holden Kowser fifth. They saved money. They were taking Judd Fabian at pick 41, except Boston took him at pick 40. A year late, but the Orioles get their guy. You were listening in because I leaned over to Carlos and said they finally got their guy. I mean, this is the guy they wanted. Tremendous power potential. Very good defensive center fielder. The swing and miss is what's been the, the, the big concern for him. And, you know, this year he went back to Florida and the first chunk of the year it looked like he was addressing some of those issues. And then in SEC play he kind of struggled some more. The power is very, very real. And the, the defense up the middle is very real. It's just going to be a question of at the pro level, Dan, do you think he's going to hit enough to, to get to those tools? Well, I mean, our game has changed at the, at the major league level where... Maybe I mean, it doesn't matter. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. If you really can get to that power, he's got great instincts in center field. He's a well above average base runner, and he's a really good baseball player. So, you know, 10 years ago, Jonathan, I think the lack of hit would really propose pose a problem. I'm not sure if that's as important in today's game as it once was. And a team like the Orioles might fall in love with the plate discipline again. Someone 62 walks, 69 strikeouts, so almost as many walks as strikeouts in his college season. Very competitive, of course, playing uh, with the Florida Gators. Judd Fabian going in the second round. A year later, the Orioles are like, yes, got him.